Everybody's right hand towards Camry right now in the name of Jesus. Lord, whatever I put on my head is on hers. Whatever I put on my chest and throat. In the name of Jesus, we bind up spirit of divination, which is what Python means in the Greek. We curse it in the name of Jesus. Jesus, Sean, focus, sit down, pretend it's you choking. Put your right hand towards her. Everybody has your camera off. All you celebrities, turn your cameras on. Come on, pretend you're Camry. Pretend you need her prayer. Hook into it, angels, in the name of Jesus. Come on, Esther. <laughs> about Camry right now. About Jesus being glorified. Hook into it and pull it out now in the name of mighty Jesus. All the way out. Come up. Fire on the head right now in the name of Jesus. Is it already gone? No? Okay. Angels open her windpipe now so she can breathe in Jesus' name. Lord Jesus, I ask that you send warrior <laughs> angels to make sure she can breathe. Enemy, we curse you in the name of Jesus Christ. Come on, focus, Sean. Use your prayer languages. Kasha, you're going, come out of my friend Camry in the name of mighty Jesus. She is a child of the living God, spirit of Python, divination. Jezebel Kundalini, I don't care what you are. In the name of Jesus, you will not stop her. Beelzebub, Baal, Mullet, come out. In the name of Jesus, any spirit causing the palsy in her body, get out in the name of mighty Jesus. We curse you in the name of Jesus. Come on, Hammer. Pure fire. Come on, Juan, Sean, Paliza, Isaac, Brittany. Come on, pray like Shalom. Come on, Nina, start getting physical with this thing. Esther, RB, Bimnet, in the name of mighty Jesus. Don't leave Bimnet, we're going to get you healed up. You strong man, we bind you. We bind you. How could one bind the strong man unless one stronger come upon you and bind the strong man and spoil his good? We strip you devil of your armor, your rank in Jesus' name. And we command you to lose Camry now in Jesus' name. We cover her in the blood of Jesus. We ransom her back to God. Father, release angels in order to arrest every evil spirit that's coming against her life and tormenting her. We torment you, devil, in the name of Jesus, the name that's above every name. Get out now in Jesus' name. We are tired of you, devil, in the name of Jesus. Father, release angels from your quarters to beat and destroy and fog and torment every single evil spirit that's come against Cammy and everyone in this room, oh God. We bind every strong man. We bind the strong man in Jesus' name. Cammy, receive peace. Receive peace. We bind every strong man. Receive the Holy Spirit. Father, open up the heavens, oh God. Let her receive the Holy Ghost. Pour out the spirit of adoption in her, Father. Let and remove all darkness, Father. Let all darkness come to the light right now in Jesus' name. I divide self and spirit right now in Jesus' name, and I sever you evil spirit off of her life right now. We bind you right now. Untie, loose your holes, uncoil, unwrap, unravel, and get out in the name of Jesus Christ. We come against you, Satan, by the power of the blood of Jesus. You are defeated foe. We command you to loose and go now in the name of Jesus Christ. The name that's above every name. The name, that name is your worst nightmare. Get out now in the name of Jesus Christ. How do you feel, Camry? Good praying, Sean. Anybody else wants to pray, you get in there. But I mean, I want some powerful deliverance here. I'm not looking for church or Sunday school prayers. I'm looking for real warriors. I mean, no offense. It's good, Sean. Good praying. Sean speaking with more and more authority. In the name of Jesus, Spirit of hell, be thou God in Jesus' name. I come against you, Spirit of hell, with the fire of God, with the sword of the Spirit of the living God. In Jesus' mighty name, I cut your head off. In Jesus' name, go thou, be thou gone in Jesus' name. Now. 
In Jesus' mighty name, fire on you. Fire of God on you. In Jesus' mighty name, spirits of hell, come out in Jesus' name. Depart now. In Jesus' name, I declare the sword of God to cut your head off. In Jesus' name, be thou gone. Go. <laughs> Depart. Pack your luggage and go in the name of Jesus. Pack all your luggage, your eggs, and go. Be mm. thou move once for all in Jesus' name. I declare the fire of God. Holy Spirit, pour down your holy fire. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. The fire of God. The fire of God against that spirit. In Jesus' name. Fight on. Go. In the name of Jesus. Go. In the name of Jesus, go! In the name of Jesus, fight in Jesus' name. Fire Go in Jesus' name. Go in Jesus' name. Go in Jesus' name. Get out in the name of Jesus' name. Go in Jesus' mighty name. I cut all the bandage in the name of Jesus in the sword of God in Jesus' mighty name. Come on, in Jesus' name. Depart in Jesus' name. Get out. Depart in Jesus' name. Go in the name of Jesus. Go in Jesus' name. All the way out. Leave that house in Jesus' mighty name. Leave that house in the name of Jesus once for all. I break you. I break your power. I break your strong God. I can root you in the name of Jesus. Go. Get out. In Jesus' mighty name. Come off in Jesus' name. Your time is gone. Your time is gone. In Jesus' name. Come on. Go in Jesus' name. I break all the powers in Jesus' mighty name all around you. The cords. You, the cords you had. You, you bind that. I bind you in the name of Jesus, Spirit of hell. Come off in Jesus' name. Depart once for all. Depart in Jesus' name. Depart in Jesus' name. Come on. I declare the fire of God on you. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Father God, pour down your holy fire. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Pour down your holy fire in Jesus' mighty name. Deliver that girl in Jesus' mighty name. Deliver her. Deliver her from that spirit and for all. Whatever spirit is. In the name of Jesus. Come on. In Jesus' name. Spirit of hell. In the name of Jesus, <laughs> come off, come off in Jesus' name, come off in Jesus' mighty name, go in Jesus' name, we reject you in Jesus' name, we renounce you in that life in Jesus' name, in our lives in Jesus' name, go in Jesus' name, in the name of Jesus, you have to obey to the name of Jesus Christ, who defeated you forever in Jesus' mighty name. Come on. Go. It's, 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 it's. it's making me feel crazy. That's all right. This is going to drive it crazy as it's burning in the lake of fire. Yes, in Jesus' name. <laughs> In the name of Jesus. Hey, uh, is Sean still here? Do you want me to pray, Nate? Nate, I can pray. Sean, yeah, I need powerful prayer. Uh, hold on one second. Sean, are you driving? Oh, you're in the back. Look up a verse. Yeah, with Michael, but I'll pray for her anyway. Hold on, name. please, 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 please. Hear the request, brother. Hear the request. Isn't there a scripture where Jesus cast out spirits of palsy? I swore there was. Yeah, I believe so. It was a centurion servant, right? And he see, told them, see if you can uh, find me. Uh, 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 uh. See if you can find me that okay. show and put it in the box. Okay, buddy? Thank you. Pastor Hammer, if you know it, put it in the box. Uh, go ahead, Sister Rosina. <laughs> we want to cast out the binding spirit of cerebral palsy. I'm really I'm sorry. I'm getting a vision. I, I want to pull off what I can see in the vision, Nate. What I'm seeing in the vision is we've got a black octopus. We've got eight arms and it's positioned. The, the head of the thing is positioned to the left of her chest. And there's legs, you know, long tentacles. That's yeah. why it's 
it's being strangled. So I'm going to just pray into that. You pick up the next bit. That's all I'm getting. Okay, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we stand together and you have said, Lord, that whatever we ask in your name, I'm not going to go right. I'm going to go into straight into this. Okay, you unclean spirit, you evil squid, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we pull you off. We rip your body apart. We pull your legs apart. We take a great big sword and we put it through your big brain now. So I am speaking to you and I am telling you to come off her now. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, you come off. She is a child of God. You have no territory here. We are standing together as the army of God. We have the power. You will come off her. Ah! We burn with the fire of God. I see it burning. We burn you with the fire of the Holy Spirit. Father, I decree and declare angels right now, Jesus. I need warring angels. I need legions in her room right now. <laughs> I need ministering angels, Lord. She's crying. We need her to know, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, that the Holy Spirit is right there next to this guard. We have got you, Cami. We know what we're doing. So, Father, I just pray right now, Lord, I pray right now that there will be a massive deliverance. Jesus, I'm going to speak the victory of the cross. Satan, whatever you are, whatever dirty little you know, little, little minnows, little, whatever they are, soldiers, whatever you've got there, I'm going to stand now in a vision from the cross and I can on the cross and I'm seeing down and I am declaring in the name of Jesus, as he looked down from that cross, he said, he made us, he said it was finished. It was finished on the cross. This squid, you, your assignment was finished on the cross. You have no power. She is free. Whom the son sets free is free indeed. Jesus, you have given us the authority. Father, we need you to speak into her spirit right now the word we need her to open up and receive the word father i speak against i bind any spirit of fear any spirit of fear any spirit of um is there do you, do you know how the palsy has started nate or anything like that is there any where's the where where is where's the input can you pick up on that now because i think i've gone as far as i need to go okay <sighs> I, I had a brain brain bleed in the womb. Okay, okay. So that's your so 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 let's so, so let's l l listen to me, sweetie. I, I'm 55. I've got a daughter your age, and and if we were there in your room, we'd be all giving you a massive hug. Okay, um, I I understand that. My 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 nephew has this issue. I understand this, but I want to speak something into you. You know, through the power of this ministry, you can be restored and you can be better than you were. I came onto this platform last week. I was on five meds. Sean testified on Friday. I'm on one now. It's virtually unheard of. Okay. So listen, you're, Jesus can restore you. He can restore you back to perfection. You're in a fallen world, but through the power of the cross and the Lord loves you and we do too. And he understands you. He understands the pain, but I'm, listen to me. I went through this three weeks ago. Okay. I I went through it with another ministry and then came to Nate and I'm still going through it and I would be still going through it for a long time to come. The pain ends, the crying, the feeling and the blessings start to come. I got a job today. I'm going to be able to support this ministry. It's incredible. I'm telling you, the blessings are coming. You hang on in here and it's hard. It's like having surgery. It's like having an operation. Let's go back into the, the womb bleed, okay? So Jesus, I, I want to speak right back to that baby Lord and I want you to put your, because Jesus is outside of time so i'm getting a vision of you in your mother's womb and jesus is putting his hand on the area of your head right now so he's restoring you right now and he wants you to know that he loves you that he's with you that he thinks you're just like he thinks you're just amazing you're the apple of his eye and he thinks you're beautiful and it doesn't matter what your family think he loves you you are a diamond you are a a, a sapphire in the hand your God and um, I'm going to speak blessing over you and you are going to make it girl you keep coming back this guy Nate he is brilliant Hammer Sean all of them on this platform Rosa um, you know Sandra we're all going through it all the others we're all here for each other we love each other and we're going to make this and we're, you're going to make it you're going to be amazing so the, I'm going to speak a blessing over you yeah go ahead sorry the, the enemy the enemy keeps telling me that this is not a God because my whole family has been attacking me that Christians 
have demons, but I believe it. Let me tell you something. Well, you know, the enemy's a liar, right? There is no truth in him, so don't believe it. Yeah, and I don't know what to do because I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. Let God fight for you. Listen to me. He who is in you, Christ is in Anybody you. Quit telling him your business, sweetie. There's nothing in your Bible that says you just got to unload all your business. I should have warned you about that. That's the first thing I do is warn everybody. I say, look, you get excited because you found the group. And Jesus showed up and they run, tell their family everything. And then their family okay. rejects them. Don't, there's nothing in the word of God that says you got to tell your business. You know what I'm what? saying? Right to kill me. Uh, um, you got your own home, right, Cameron? So you can spend all. Cameron, just exemplify Christ in your life. Let them see Christ. Don't so you don't have to speak about it, right? Can we can we go back to casting out the demons? Yeah, you go on, Sandra. I'm done. You look great today, though. By the way, me. Yeah, you. Oh, you go. Okay, I can cast out demons. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you. <laughs> So in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, we take authority over you right now in Jesus' name. And we open up a pocket realm right about you in Jesus' name right now, where Jesus can minister to you, can we? And we fill that pocket realm right now with the agape love of God, peace and joy and understanding, minister to angels and minister to her right now in Jesus and minister to her. And we call a fire round about it in Jesus' name. And in the name of Jesus Christ, and I'll cast you out, our evil spirits, I'll take my authority over you. In the name of Jesus, I cast you out. I command you to go. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pour living water all over you right now in Jesus' name. And chairs of fire, and they are blaze fire of God right now about you. Look into my eyes, demons. You will go in Jesus' name. I take my authority you. All demons, all serpents, all power serpents, listen to me, you spirit of serpent, you python, you kundalini serpent, you incubus, succubus, you nasty devils in the name of Jesus Christ. I renounce you on behalf of Cameron right now. We serve you a bill of divorce in the name of Jesus. We pull up all hidden documents, scrolls, certificate, old vows. In the name of Jesus, and Tangley Camry, we command it to be stamped with the blood of Jesus and by what you did on the cross in the name of Jesus. And we cast you out. Our territory in Camry right now, we bind you up in the name of Jesus. We renounce you. We renounce all your tethering to Camry right now. You will leave in Jesus' name. We cast you out. Our spirits, our eggs, leave in Jesus' name. All serpents, all scorpions, we have authority over you. We cast you out in Jesus' name. Our octopus spirits, our suction part of the head, we break you, we pull up our cords, we pull up our ley lines, we shop them up, but it's sort of the spirit right now in Jesus' name, we just cast you out in Jesus' name, and you will listen, and you will go. Like, look at me, Camry. I'm speaking to the demons. You hear me? You hear me in Jesus' name. You see Jesus inside my eyes, and we command you to go in Jesus' name. You have no authority in Jesus' name. You have no authority here. We strip you of your rank and armor and everything. We command you to go in Jesus' name. Let go right now in Jesus' name. We command you. We command you to go in Jesus' name. Leave her alone. Go out. Whatever opening you can find, you will leave in Jesus' name. Leave right now. Heroa spirit, devil spirits, incubus, succubus spirits. Medusa spirits, all evil wicked spirits, all marine spirits, all mermaid spirits, all spirits of the python, leave in Jesus' name right now. Come out now in Jesus' name. We command it to go. You will listen to me. You will not choke her. You will not hurt her. And you will leave in Jesus' name. Be all about leave. Molik, leave all wicked spirits. Leave. We bind you up and we cast you out. Go now in Jesus' name. We command it to go. Go now in Jesus' name. We bind you up and cast you out. Go in Jesus' name. Leave in Jesus' name. We shut you up in Jesus' name. Any part of her soul, soul fragments, part you have stolen in the name of Jesus, we cleanse them in living water and we return them to her in Jesus' name. Whatever you mess with her soul, whatever you mess with her body, we cleanse it with living water right now. We strip you of all of her soul, but we strip you of all of your, your works around her in Jesus' name. We command it to go in Jesus' name. Leave and return everything you stole from her in Jesus' name. Vomit it up. 
vomit her blessings up. Vomit you know. everything you have stolen from her. Leave in Jesus' name. According to Job 2014 to 16, vomit them up in Jesus' name. And leave now. Leave. <laughs> Leave in Jesus' name. Amen. Become quite the little deliverance warrior there, Sandra. You've been hiding that back from Pastor Nate. If I'd have known you were praying like that now, I'd have been putting you to work sooner. Hammer said yeah. the same thing. That's good praying. Camry, look at me. Is that a smile? Okay, amen. I think something came out a while ago. Like it to me. Say, say this out loud from the whole group. Say, Jesus, I receive it. Jesus, I receive it. I receive your peace. Receive your peace. You were my everything. You were my everything. I love my family. I love my family. But I don't need their approval. Say it. It's okay. Yeah. I need Jesus' approval. Jesus' approval. We're going to honor your parents, brothers, and sisters, and people you love where necessary. But you belong to Jesus. You're a grown woman. We're not going to disrespect them, but there's nothing in the word of God that says we just got to subject ourselves to unbelief. I know you want them to love you. you it's all, all around me, and I, I don't want my heart to get hard. I know. I know. And that's probably why you left for a while, and I think I knew that. And I know your dad's a, a, a minister and all that. I'm sure he's a great man of God, but we go straight by this Bible and evidence, you know, you're in the right place. I don't need to sell you, but evidence of that is that the enemy's telling you this isn't godly. If this isn't godly, we need to all take these things and get rid of them and shut this group down. Cause this is, I mean, I'm going to be honest. This is about as, <laughs> Woo! I feel the Holy ghost. This is about as godly as it gets right here. We're, we're nothing but God. We're nothing but Jesus. So, and I know, you know, that, but we don't have to have their approval. You know where you're going to get it? Are you are you in a wheelchair or crutches or or how? What's what? I have. Cr I was going to show you. I have crutches. Okay. It, you you know you know where your parents are going to get sold when you walk in that room one day with no crutches, running in place, and then you yeah. moonwalk across the kitchen floor. I promise you. That's I, when your parents are going to say they did the same thing to RB. She she couldn't talk. Her body was mangled. Is she getting freer and freer? Now all she does is talk. And her I, doctor said, I don't know who this group is. I don't know who this maniac is running this group you go to, but you need to keep going to it. This is what her doctor told her. He'd been with her 40 years, been pumping medicines into her since she, she was a baby. And she just went down and said, I don't need any of this stuff anymore. I said, now I can move my arm. I can talk. I can. And he said, I don't know who these maniacs are, but you keep going to this group. And I'm going to say the same thing. The, 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 plan, the plan that I have is once it happens, I want to walk the street and um, evangelize. Yeah. Well, guess who's going to be coming up to Virginia and we're going to be walking together. <laughs> Yeah, but you and Pastor Nate, and we probably gather a few more people up, like RB lives near you. You're in Virginia, right? Yeah, amen. So, Brother <laughs> Sean, meet us over there. Who knows? Sister Shalom, maybe fly down. Yeah, holla. I'll fly. You're doing good. Pastor, Pastor Nate, we should plan for a crusade soon, bro. Well, we did. We went to Africa. We go back when the Lord tells us. No, God. here in America, too. All right, so uh, Yannick, uh, come and pray for you. Shoot, by then, Shalom. Go, I mean, uh, what's your face? Uh, Cameron gonna be praying for other people. Mm, yeah. yeah. So listen, here's the deal, Cameron. You keep coming, sweetie. We had a big day mm. yesterday. The Lord, uh, I guess you felt it too, was all over us when we were praying for you yesterday. I I, I feel selfish about this. Oh, no. That's just demons. That's just demons. That's what you're here for is to receive prayer. And then you become a part of the church. I mean, Sandra went through that stuff when she got, I mean, she just constantly needed prayer. I mean, you'd look up, she'd be beating her head against the wall and you're like, uh, uh, or grabbing her throat going, uh, Sandra, do you need prayer? And she's like, ah, ah, ah. yeah, I mean, so it makes you feel selfish, but we can either sit there. And <laughs> yeah. We can either sit there and let her get choked. I mean, you wrote me and said, Pastor Nate, I need 
prayer and I wrote you back. I said, uh, is it like an emergency? Like we need to stop now. And you were like, yeah, I think so. I mean, I asked you a question. You gave me an answer. So yeah, then don't feel guilty. That's just the condemnation. All of that's going to come out and you just keep loving your family. Don't try to sell them. Don't argue. Don't give them scriptures. I mean, just, just kind of wash their feet, so to speak. Just, you're right, Dad. I'm sure the miracles were, were for the days of the apostles. Uh, I love you, Dad. You're such an awesome man of God. And, this, this, you know, this, yeah. This, yeah, this, Cameron, you're going through the same reactions that I went through from coming here. You learn so much. You learn the deep, the meat of the scripture. Right. And, uh, to and put you're it in trying effect. to ramp, yeah. you're trying to ram meat down somebody who's not even on milk or maybe on milk. And they're, like Paul said, they're choking on it. They can't receive it when you know the deep things of God, right? We, and uh, and basically, so I was getting yeah. the same reactions as you. So just stay in the secret place with God and keep coming to group and get your deliverance and show them the glory of God in your life. Show them the awesome healing power of God and the Holy Spirit. And then and then you'll win them that way because, uh, you know, you just corrupt their demons when you, tell them the work, when you tell them the stuff you know, right? Yeah. And um, my my stepdad, he just got diagnosed with stage three stomach cancer. Well, he needs to be here. I guarantee you he'll let us pray for him. I guarantee he will. And I'll send him a washcloth too. I'm going to be getting those tonight. I'm going to go to the revival tonight. I'm going to stick him in the pool. I'm going to I feel the Lord every time I say that. I'm going to pray for him. We, we, we already started sending him to that little baby that rb had in virginia that that they sent it home to die at nine months or nine years with the brain tumor and that man i felt the holy ghost praying with brother paul at the church and then all of a sudden the baby before the cloth even got there sent rb goes the baby's starting to live and do better and they'd sent it home to die and uh yeah. i mean that's how the lord works here i mean it's not here it's him it's, it's, right it's all god yeah so we need to get a your stepdad in here, but I love you, okay? We all love you. Just keep coming. Don't fight and argue with them. I wouldn't tell them your business. It's not like we're in a some kind of horrible group. And, and you, I mean, you don't have to tell them your business is all I'm saying. That Believe it or not, that's, you know, you don't have to let the left hand know what you're doing. You're, everything you're doing is totally kingdom here. You just keep doing it and let, when you walk in that room, that'll speak for itself. Thank you. Yeah, don't you don't you agree with that strategy? Yeah, they just watch everything I do. Uh, it's really hard. But you have your own place, right? Yeah, but they watch me. How do they watch you? The, uh, my my grandparents have me. It's all about Jesus and the good things he's done. Why these gates? Let's see his kingdom come.